Space Dog, All About Jupiter, written by Mary Blake, illustrated by Comet Whithouse. Meet Levy. He is traveling with Space Dog, who knows all about space. Already, they have visited the Earth's moon, Mars, Mercury, and Venus. Where are we going next? Levy asked. To Jupiter, right here. Replied Space Dog, pointing to a planet on his monitor. Destination Jupiter! Exclaimed Levy. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the sun, said Space Dog. Is it big? Asked Levy. It's the biggest planet, actually. Replied Space Dog, smiling. After a little while, they reached Jupiter. There it is, said Space Dog. Wow, it's huge! Cried Levy as his eyes followed Space Dog's fingers to a big planet ahead. How long until we land? Asked Levy. I'm afraid we can't land at all, said Space Dog. There is no land and nothing solid to land on. Jupiter is made entirely of gases. What a pity! Levy sighed. We can't land or stand on Jupiter, but we can fly around and give you a good look at it," said Space Dog. As they flew closer, Levy could see Jupiter's different colored gas bands. He had an idea. Space Dog, let's fly straight through it," he suggested excitedly. Bad idea," said Space Dog. "The outside of Jupiter is cold gas, but the center is extremely hot." He steered the ship closer, dodging one of Jupiter's moons. Levy noticed several other moons around Jupiter. "How many moons does Jupiter have anyway?" he asked. "More than fifty," said Space Dog. "That was too many," Levy thought. What's that? Levy asked, pointing to a giant red spot. It's the great red spot, a huge raging storm. Replied Space Dog. You can even see it from Earth through a telescope. Amazing! Yelled Levy, writing down the interesting fact. Now it's time for us to visit another planet, said Space Dog. Steering the spaceship away from the gas giant Jupiter.